Hi everyone, it's Mama Pudding. In today's video, we're going to take a trip down memory lane and redesign some characters from the Strawberry Shortcake franchise. Strawberry Shortcake is a character originally created as a simple illustration of a Valentine's card by Barbie Sargent. After that, she became rather popular and so they kept on using the character and eventually added a few friends to the lineup, each one with a fruit slash dessert theme. After that, dolls and a few TV specials were made in the 80s. Later, they made a full series in 2003. I still remember watching this series and loving it a lot. I decided to make this video in part because Strawberry Shortcake, or as we call it here, do Sing do Morango, was a big part of my childhood, but also because I keep seeing dolls with the old designs in a, in a shop near my college. I'm pretty sure they're replicas, but they are really really cute nonetheless. Now, I wasn't sure about how to redesign them, especially in terms of how old the characters actually are. They are clearly kids, but in later iterations they are business owners and drive cars, so I got a bit confused. I searched a bit and originally she was supposed to be 6, but in the animated series they ended up aging her up to 19 in the 2009 version. I had a long range of ages to choose from, so I decided to design them as teenagers. Strawberry Shortcake is a kind, caring, optimistic and energetic. Because of that, I decided to design her with practical clothes. I also gave her a hat with strawberry print because that and red hair seem to be the design traits that prevail the most. I also kept her original short shaggy hair instead of the later long well-kept hairstyle. In the version I grew up with, she was also kind of a tomboy, something they later changed but I wanted to keep this in my design despite her clear favoritism for the color pink. The next one I decided to redraw was Orange Blossom or Laranjinha, a way color here. Uh, she is always depicted as Strawberry's best friend, she loves nature and she's one of the most sensitive characters, that's why I drew her crying. I think she turned out really cute. I gave her an orange body type, cute comfortable clothing, and I also gave her dreads. In her original form she had coily hair, but in the 2009 version they gave her wavy hair, which is a bit sad, but I understand why they did it. 3D modeling curly hair is really hard and its physics work in a completely different way from straight hair because they basically move like springs and the show probably didn't have the budget or technology to make it work. From my understanding, which granted is very limited, hair is a very important part of black culture, so I wanted to give her a traditional black hairstyle. I also gave her glasses, because I think it is a really cute accessory, and it suits her, in my opinion anyway. Finally, the girly girl of this trio is Lemon Meringue, or Limonzino. She is sweet and innocent, although a bit of a diva every now and then. She loves styling hair and accessories and things like that. So basically, your classic girly girl. I gave her lemon earrings, a leaf themed hair tie, cute summer dress and I thought she would be the type to wear makeup, so I gave her lipstick. I liked lemon and strawberry the most as a kid, probably because of their colors. Pink, my favorite color at the time and yellow, my current favorite color. The fashion in these character designs were inspired by the, I guess you could call, 90s slash soft girl slash cottage core aesthetic I see so often on my Pinterest feed. And there you have it, my version of Strawberry Shortcake and her friends. If you've gotten this far, please consider liking the video, leave a comment or, su or subscribe. Either way, thank you so much for watching and until next time, bye!